Hi, Paige here, the One Foot Flipper. Apparently people who work at eBay do watch my channel. Stay tuned for more. One Foot Flipper. So last week I got a message on the eBay forums from Alexis in the eBay uh, shipping department. Uh, apparently the shipping department had seen my videos on standard envelope card shipping and they were eager to see what I thought about their new product that they made specifically for card shipping. So they sent me a whole box of them. Let's open them up now and see what they look like. Then I will go over them completely. I'll compare them to what I normally do and just let you know what I think about them. Every bit cost included. All right. Like they sent me. All right, looks like it consists of a stiffener panel. What do we got in here? A three pocket insert. and an ebay envelope itself assume how it's going to work is you put your cards in the three pocket put the stiffener panel in there and you put it inside the ebay branded envelope all right let's uh go to the desk and test test this out and one of the best things about uh, about these envelopes is they not only hold your normal standard size cards, they will hold sleeve cards and thicker cards. And those the thicker cards are the things that I often find harder to ship than normal because they don't work with my normal method. But your thicker cards will drop right into here with ease. All right, now my usual packing method for cards involves you've got the card you want to card put somebody ordered a. Uh, nice foil magic card signed by me uh, I use that I normally use normal envelope and gaming card sleeves as well as stacks of your good old worthless tops baseball cards from the early 90s what I normally do is I take three of those tops baseball cards or score or whatever they are I slide my good card in the middle of that slide this into the gaming sleeve use some double-sided tape tape that off center inside the envelope close the envelope print the label put the label on it you always I always do, do off center and I suggest you do off center on any things of single cards is so that the whole envelope can be bent in half and not do any damage whatsoever that's what i normally do now let's look at these let's look at these ebay supplies instead all right let's uh simulate a bigger order because i think that's where these are really going to shine at to quickly do your bigger order so let's say i got a nice 15 card order normally what i would have done with a 15 card order is that i would have put I would have done three, I would have separately taped in three separate sleeves, each with five cards inside. This time we're just going to put our first five in, going to, that goes in there nicely. Oh look, Beanie Baby cards. That goes in there nicely. And that goes in, in as well now some people are concerned about shipping this way without there being anything truly hard but i have shipped so many cards with so few actual damage that this doesn't bother me whatsoever and that ebay standard envelope is insured in the first place so there's no need for you to worry about about damage when it's already insured honestly I like this even without the stiffener panel. The stiffener, stiffener panel is just an add-on. I, I'm not even sure if it's necessary. Okay, it, it bends about the same either way. So you taper up. In this case, I'd probably put the label on the front and voila, not bad. If I was only sending one to five cards, I would instead pack off center. I could put one order here, one order there. The re the reason you alternate is so that stack of, when the post office gets that stack of envelopes from you 
that it's gonna sit flat. When I used to stick them all in the middle, I used to have some trouble with post office employees, but when I started alternating the, the hunk of cards from left to the right, one over to the next, those troubles just went away. Overall, I really like this product. It is it is a bit pricey. It's the sort of thing you might wanna you know be using that eBay quarterly shipping supplies coupon on that I think that gets it down to a pretty good price point it gets it down to about the same price point as a top loader and this will give you much less problems than top loaders will so I would use this over a top loader any day of the week all right and I think that's about all I've got about this here so hey everybody thanks for watching please do subscribe to subscribe to my channel I've got plenty more information about cards and about selling on eBay in general. Thanks, and I hope to see you again soon.